For 1037 The Game and 1037thegame.com at Alec Box Stadium in Baton Rouge, Louisiana, the LSU Tigers open up the 2015 baseball season with a 4-1 to win over the Kansas Jayhawks. Jared Poche getting the nod on Friday night, going six shutout innings, giving up just a pair of base hits, walking one and striking out five. He got plenty of support from his battery mate, a three-run shot from Cade Savik. Well, the first pitch I saw was a slider. I was uh, a little out in front of it, and then the last pitch I hit, he hung a slider up and in. Just um, right in the bad zone and hit it hard. Oh, yeah, it was a great time. Uh, crowd, crowd was great. Um, you know, we played great defense and uh, came in a clutch and had some clutch hits, so it was a good night. Yeah, it, was, it was a pretty business-like victory with a few clutch hits. Uh, and I, I know tomorrow we'll come out and swing the bats even with more authority and more confidence, and hopefully we'll get the same kind of game pitched and played on defense. Uh, Jared's a great pitcher. He threw um, every one of his pitches. All three of his pitches worked really well. Um, he located his fastball, his curveball, and his changeup at all times. Yeah, I think he had nine home runs last year, so, um, you know, it's no surprise. But, uh, I mean, Cade came in in a big situation, threw on his own, and, uh, you know, got a good pitch to hit and took advantage of it, so. Christian A's RBI single accounted for the other LSU Tigers run. Jesse Stallings took a 4-1 lead in the ninth inning to try to close it out for the Tigers. He gave up a leadoff double, but then struck out the next three Jayhawk batters. Once again, your final score from Alec Box Stadium in Baton Rouge, Louisiana. The LSU Tigers open up the 2015 season with a 4-1 win over the Kansas Jayhawks. For 1037 The Game and 1037thegame.com, I'm Dave Schultz.